Hello there, welcome back to the new lecture. So in this lecture, we have to discuss about the automatic chill water piping layout. So how to create chill water piping layout automatically that we have to discuss. So here I have taken one example. Suppose this is our ground floor of a school building and here I have decided to place the separate FCU for each and every space. See, here I have placed the FCU. So for automatic piping layout, you have to select the FCU or mechanical equipment from the drawing with the help of control key. Okay, like this. Okay. After that, modify tab, create system panel. Here you will get the option of piping. Hit on piping. Now from the system type, you have to select which type of pipe you want to create. Piping layout you want to create for chill water supply or return. So first I will show you about the chill water supply pipe. Hit on chill water supply ok now here see you will get the option generate layout in layout panel hit on generate layout here you will get the different pipe routine so as per that your requirement you can select any of the routine so let's say I am selecting this one first one this routine hit on finish layout now see the pipe layout is created you want to see the double line diagram so from VCB hit on find first now come here in 3D see the routine which we have drawn it is looking like this okay this is our chill water supply pipe but here the problem is what we know that fall ceiling is at 10 feet but the main pipe when i'm selecting see the bottom of main pipe is showing 8.943 feet so we have to run this chill water supply pipe above the fall ceiling so okay how much 10.5 feet just write down 10.5 feet apply automatically see the pipe uh, bottom will be changed okay from manually you can change the pipe bottom as per requirement see so here we have drawn uh, the chill water piping in this way only we have to do it okay same way now suppose let's say if you want to uh, do chill water pipe sizing automatic chill water pipe sizing so that option is also available in Revit so how to do see simple come here in ground floor plan now we have done the automatic chill water pipe layout so for chill water pipe sizing Go to 3D view. In 3D only it is possible. Like this. Now take mouse near to any of the pipe. To uh, any of the pipe segment. And press tab key to select the complete piping. So I have selected this pipe segment. Press the tab key. Double time. Again. Then left click. See the complete piping layout is selected. Na? Now modify tab. Pipe. Here you will get the option uh, in modify tab analysis panel. Here you will get the option of duct or pipe sizing. Hit on that. See velocity how much we have to maintain. All of you, all of you know for in chill water pipe sizing, always we have to maintain 4 FPS velocity. So write down 4 FPS here. And finally hit on OK. So see it is showing sizing fail. Flow for section is zero. Why it is showing sizing fail? because here we have not connected to this pipe to the chiller na? that is why the sizing is showing fail so first of all what you have to do first from here just how much size of pipe you have to take the pipe up and connect it to the chiller okay so chiller we have placed in the roof flow you can see here so what I am doing now see from here uh, we have an option chill water in out both so from here it is not possible so I am creating the section to see this view now just right click go to view see uh, here we have placed the chiller hit on fine to see the section view of chiller hit on that now see when you select the chiller here you will get both so you can change the diameter as per your pipe size ok so here 6 inch both out in so we are doing the chill water supply pipe uh, routine we have already draw so out from the chiller chill water will supply now to the HU so here are what I am doing right click draw pipe option is good draw the pipe like this whatever size is there you can draw it now come here in a uh, roof flow the pipe is visible here yes see hit on find from here now you have to take this pipe down okay remember this point so let's say suppose from the OTS only just I'm what I'm doing just I'm taking the pipe down from here so for create the down riser what we have to do all of you know 
so that I will show you come here in floor plan from here just I, I want to draw the same size of pipe so I'm create hit on create similar so here the OTS is not visible so in ceiling plan I think it is visible now see when you come in ceiling plan the OTS is visible select this pipe right click create similar from here see what I am doing suppose this is our main pipe now I am taking this pipe to connect the chiller so how much riser let's say 50 feet I have written double hit on apply now see the riser which we have created in 3d this is our riser pipe now we have to connect this pipe to this one okay so come here in roof floor plan automatically you will get the reducer and everything first align it then only it is possible to connect so for an I a hit on modify tab align I want to align this this center to this pipe okay see the pipe will align now connect it in section first create the section like this right click go to view here you can see the pipe hit on fine see this is our pipe okay so from here you can just uh, drag it little bit like this now what I am doing see just uh, here only from here what I am doing just create it up to here is okay then right click drop uh, from your draw pipe option is given anywhere just draw the pipe take the pipe down and connect it automatically you will get the reducer also okay so here we have done the connection now come here in 3d view see now we have done the we have connected this to the chiller now I want to do the piping automatic piping so take mouse near to any of the pipe segment press the tab key to select the complete piping see now the complete piping is selected same way you have to do for each and every floor okay just I am showing you analysis panel hit on duct pipe sizing 4 fps velocity okay now see automatic pipe size will be done by the Revit see when you come here in floor plan now you want to give the tagging okay so TG and give the tag ha a one and a half inch pipe size one one by four inch pipe size three by four inch pipe size okay same way here also you can change the tag you want to see the invert elevation flow value okay select any of the tag edit family option is given select the size already I have discussed this in ducting suppose you want to see the flow system uh, flow value add it you want to see invert elevation add it okay before the size you want to see to write uh, chill water supply okay write on chill water supply otherwise don't need to write here you can add system abbreviation also where is system abbreviation anywhere search okay add it I want to see this system abbreviation in top so select move parameter up option is given move it like this so check break before the flow I want to see add the rate invert level bottom of pipe before that I want to see bottom of pipe apply okay now from here you can drag it like this first you have to save it so file save as what family save it to the desired location like in desktop with the name uh, pipe sizing pipe sizing tag okay save it then finally load into project and close so how to load see option is given load into project in which project which project you want to load just load it okay so okay so the tagging is loaded orient of the view must be logged before you can add tag okay now come here in floor plan select any of the tag existing tag now already we have saved uh, see pipe sizing tag replace it with the select the existing tag from the drawing replace it with the updated one see now here you will get the chill water supply or return pipe name is given their diameter flow value bottom of pipe is also showing okay so as per your requirement you can change it same way you can do for chill water return pipe so this is in this way we have to draw the automatic piping layout and automatic chill water pipe sizing 
but in our project we have to do manual we have to run the manual layout piping layout and manual piping sizing okay with the help of graph that I will show you manual method also so up to here we have cover here the chill water pipe sizing and chill water automatic piping layout I hope all of you enjoy the session see you in next one